You're about to meet two gentlemen from Louisiana who ate so much they actually got banned from their local Chinese buffet. You're outside of your favorite Chinese restaurant right now, and was um, our favorite. Uh, <laughs> your former favorite. Now tell us what happened. What? Take us through the whole thing and tell us what happened. Okay, the Friday night before Christmas, we decided to come out here and eat. We've been eating here for about the last eight months, maybe. Once, twice a week, skip a week, come back when we felt like eating Chinese food again. Yeah. So the night we walk in there, that Friday before Christmas, we was greeted very friendly. We sat down at the table. They already knew what we wanted to drink, iced tea. So me and Mike proceed to the bar to fix our plate. Right. So I walk to the bar. I pick up three, maybe four, ball shrimp put in my plate because the pan was empty at this time. Uh huh. I didn't go to the frog legs. I pick up four frog legs because there's two frog legs to every frog unless it's triple. Right. So I go and I get me two to three shrimp balls. Right. So I get me some uh, Chinese rice. I go back to the table. Uh -huh. I'm undoing my napkin to get my fork. Yeah. Cut my first shrimp ball in half, <laughs> put it in my mouth, start well, chewing slow it. Slow down. I want to get every detail. <laughs> okay. Put it in my mouth, started chewing it. All of with a sudden, what, the waitress walks up. Uh -huh. Yeah, with my teeth. <laughs> yeah, all right. So, all of a sudden, the waitress slaps a ticket on the table with two fortune cookies. Right. At this moment, I'm trying to chew my shrimp ball and swallow it. She makes the comment. What if you she... guys, if you guys serve yourself again, you will be charged twenty dollars per person because Wendy said y'all are fat, Ooh. overweight, and eat too much. And which of I those things are true? Ball. I swallowed my shrimp ball by the hardest. Right. I done return to talk to her again. She makes the statement. Mike Borelli here looks like he has baby in stomach. <laughs> at this point, at this point in time, and Mike, I look you up are not, you are, you do not have a baby in your stomach right now. No, I don't think. You got a full-grown adult in there. Yeah. And now, we, is there a sizzler or anything in the neighborhood that you can go to, or I mean, what are you gonna no, do? Sir, what we did. This past Friday night, mm -hmm. Mike asked me to go out and eat again, uh -huh. and uh, we wound up going back to the place we used to go to, which is Dragon Gardens. Okay. It was very friendly. We served ourselves, was treated very nicely. See that? It was never told a comment. Mm -hmm. In fact, when Mike paid the bill that night, because we take turns paying bill, the bill, Yeah. The, the owner of the restaurant came up to me and shook my hand, and that was it. When you got... <laughs> it's some story.